And is Private First Class Joshua I. Palomo from Whittier, California. The honor graduate for platoon 3202 and the company honor graduate is Private First Class Matthew W. Shannon from Flower Mound, Texas. Private First Class Shannon is also the recipient of the Jesse Puller Award for his outstanding meritorious performance while in recruit training. The honor graduate for platoon 3203 is Private First Class Joseph T. Moyer from Wisconsin Rapids, Wisconsin. The honor graduate for platoon 3205 is Private First Class Edgar Estrada from Mesquite, Texas. The honor graduate for platoon 3206 is Private First Class Damian E. Garcia from Granada Hills, California. And the honor graduate for platoon 3207 and the series honor graduate is Private First Class C.N.D. Dunn from Menifee, California. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the honor graduates of Company I. The pass in review is a tradition within all military units, allowing the unit commander to formally inspect the unit under their charge. More than a million Marines have completed their training here in the past 100 years and have departed San Diego for combat in conflicts around the world, including places whose names are immediately associated with Marine courage and dedication. Names such as Guadalcanal, Tarawa, Iwo Jima, Pusan, Inchon, Chosen Reservoir, Quezon, Way City, Lebanon, Granada, Panama, Kuwait, Somalia, Fallujah, Ramadi, Marja, Sangen, and our most current operations worldwide. This parade deck is rich in history and tradition, and no Marine trained here ever forgets its sights and sounds. Ladies and gentlemen, as the national flag passes directly in front of you, please rise. Once it passes, you may be seated. Ladies and gentlemen, the Commander of Troops, Captain Nelson P. Sharps, and the Regimental Staff.
Marine Band San Diego, Marine Corps Recruit Depot, San Diego, California. Series 3201, Series Commander, Captain Kyle M. Kelly, and Honor Platoon 3201, Senior Drill Instructor, Staff Sergeant Delonzo Sharp. Platoon 3202, Senior Drill Instructor Sergeant Clayton D. Inman. Platoon 3203, Senior Drill Instructor Sergeant Gustavo A. Felix. The Regimental Color Guard is led on the march by the Regimental Color Sergeant, Drill Instructor Sergeant Rodolfo Navarrete. Series 3205, Series Commander Captain Austin J. Musfelt, and Platoon 3205, Senior Drill Instructor Staff Sergeant Jacob E. Landis. Platoon 3206, Senior Drill Instructor, Staff Sergeant Xavier F. Nava. Platoon 3207, Senior Drill Instructor, Staff Sergeant Eric A. Smith. Ladies and gentlemen, if you turn to page 21 of your graduation pamphlets, you will find the Marines hymn. 
The Marines Hymn has a history dating back to 1859 and has a long-standing tradition for Marines to face the direction of the music and stand at attention when it is heard. It is now directed that all Marines present and who have served honorably, and ladies and gentlemen, you're all encouraged to join. Sing the words to the first verse as Marine Band San Diego performs Anchors Away, followed by the Marines Hymn. Will the guests please rise? Thank you. Please be seated. The Marine Corps' uniqueness and strength as an elite fighting force is directly attributable to the magnificent efforts of the drill instructors and company officers who train and supervise the recruits. The distinct qualities of spirit and discipline, the heart and soul of every Marine have been developed, nurtured, and ingrained in recruits through their observance and relationship with their drill instructors and officers. Recruit training is the very foundation of the Corps. Each year, recruit provides thousands of America's finest young men and women with the basic knowledge and skills to function in a profession characterized by its own set of high values and tough standards. The most important thing we do in the Marine Corps is make Marines. The individual Marine is the Corps. That is what we do here. As the Marines prepare to fill the ranks of our Corps, they do so with unquestionable support for the high ideals and tough standards of the United States of America and the United States Marine Corps. Although Company I prepares for their final dismissal from boot camp, their initial training is not over. Soon after graduation, they will report to the School of Infantry, Camp Pendleton, California, where they will continue to be trained to serve as an effective member of a Marine Rifle Squad. The intense initial training that every Marine undergoes is designed to instill the fundamental premise that every Marine is a rifleman.
Ladies and gentlemen, at this time, we would like to introduce to you the Marines responsible for ensuring the success of the difficult transition required to become a Marine. The company commander is Captain Nelson P. Sharps. The company first sergeant is First Sergeant Kelvin E. Carrington. Ladies and gentlemen, please join me in a round of applause for the company staff of Company I. The next portion of the ceremony will be the traditional function of retiring the guidons. The guidons have been carried by the platoons throughout recruit training and are being retired to symbolize the disbanding of platoons. All similar units in the Marine Corps carry such guidons, which identify the unit and are a source of pride to each individual member. Note that the honor of carrying these guidons is bestowed upon those Marines who displayed outstanding leadership qualities, motivation, and character, and were selected as the platoon honor graduates. The platoon honor graduates compete for the titles of series and company honor graduate. They are considered the top Marines graduating today and have demonstrated the highest potential for future leadership and responsibility in the Marine Corps. The guidons will now be returned to the drill instructors. The honor graduates will now be presented a plaque by the battalion commander, Lieutenant Colonel M. Matthew Phelps, and the company first sergeant, first sergeant Kelvin E. Carrington. Ladies and gentlemen, please hold your applause until all honor graduates have been recognized. Present. Pause. Order. Pause. The honor graduate for platoon 3201 is Private First Class Joshua I. Palomo from Whittier, California. The honor graduate for platoon 3202 and the company honor graduate is Private First Class Matthew W. Shannon from Flower Mound, Texas. 
Private First Class Shannon is also the recipient of the Jesse Puller Award for his outstanding meritorious performance while in recruit training. The honor graduate for Platoon 3203 is Private First Class Joseph T. Moyer from Wisconsin Rapids, Wisconsin. The honor graduate for Platoon 3205 is Private First Class Edgar Estrada from Mesquite, Texas. The honor graduate for Platoon 3206 is Private First Class Damian E. Garcia from Granada Hills, California. And the honor graduate for Platoon 3207 and the series honor graduate is Private First Class C.N.D. Dunn from Menifee, California. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, the honor graduates of Company I. Reporting is order. Dismiss the company. Aye, sir. The company first sergeant will now give the command to the senior drill instructors to dismiss their platoons. Needless to say, this will be the most welcome command they have received throughout recruit training. Ladies and gentlemen, this concludes today's ceremony.
Ladies and gentlemen, as a reminder, please do not cross the parade deck and utilize the far ends. Pick up any trash around you and utilize all waste receptacles. Please start making your way towards the parking lot. Utilize